Hey everyone, this is John at The Drone Life, and today I'm going to be showing you how to project uh, what your Crystal Sky monitor sees onto a TV. Um, so this is, you know, with the Matrice, um, with the Sentence Controller, um, and if you're wondering, you know, if you're public safety or maybe you're on a construction site and you want other people looking at your screen, but re you really shouldn't have them looking over your shoulder because that gets awkward and sometimes annoying. Um, so this is a great thing to do, um, is what I do is I just have this TV here, I, I just bring this with me if I need it, um, and then it's really simple actually, all you have to do is plug in an HDMI cable and it, it comes up immediately. Uh, there's no nothing in the settings or anything, so I'm, I'm going to show you how this works. Um, so there's two different ways you can do this. One of them is by plugging in the HDMI to the uh, Crystal Sky uh, port. And what this does is it shows on the TV here, it shows what the drone sees, you know, what your screen right here sees. And then if I open up the settings, it's going to show literally everything that the screen is showing on the TV. Now, if you want to have, you know, say if you're doing a search and rescue, looking for people, um, but you don't, you know, maybe I have to do something in the settings here, but maybe, um, but that's kind of, blocking, you know, blocking some of the screen of what people could be seeing people on the TV. Um, so what you could do is just unplug it and then on the back of the sentence controller uh, plug the HDMI in there. And then now what you get is a feed of just what the drone is seeing. Um, there's just the box down there because I don't have my camera equ um, equipped right now. Um, but um, so if I open up a setting on my controller here, this box, nothing comes up on the TV, but, you know, it's still live, so I'm moving around my camera right now, and it's still, it's a live view, uh, but it's just not showing all the stats and everything, but you can see some, some of them in the top and the bottom, um, but if you wanted to get rid of those entirely, you can, you know, just use your, go in your TV settings and crop, you know, the screen a little bit, um, one thing to mention is it can be hard to see these TVs in the in the sunlight, uh, so you definitely want to do it in the in the shade, if possible. But definitely also go into your TV settings and put the brightness all the way up. Um, and there's different there could be different profiles where the, the the screen might be brighter or darker. So look at the TV settings as well. Uh, so yeah, that was just a quick video showing you how to hook up the TV with the sentence controller. If you got any questions, uh, let me know. And one more, one more thing to mention um, is make sure you think think into consideration um, how far away you're going to be controlling the drone from the TV. So I have like a 10 foot HDMI cable, um, and so just remember, you know, how close do you want to be to the TV if you want to be really far away. Make sure you get a long HDMI cable. Um, also, also make sure you don't, you know, tug on anything and have the TV fall over or anything like that. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, thanks for watching.